kind of amazing because all over the world, if I'm traveling, Soho House can still be home base. Now make yourself cry. Yeah. Oh, I can do that so well. Okay. Oh my God, it's crazy. You're like, Megan, one tear, left eye, go. Give me three seconds. Hey, hey, YouTube family, how you doing? This is Rhonda with Rhonda Loves Life. Thanks for joining me. In this video, we're gonna discuss Miss Meghan Markle. As you guys could tell, I've seen that famous picture now. She's at the Queen's funeral and she's got that one little tear rolling down her face. Do you believe it was fake or do you believe it was real? I call fake. Listen, as you can see, as you saw in the video clip, and I will replay it again at the end of this video, Megan declares to the world, this was a couple of years ago, that she could make herself cry within three seconds, okay? So I think in this case today, that little tear, that was nothing more than a photo op. You know it's all about Megan. It's not about the queen, it's not about Prince Harry or the other royal members. It's all about Megan and we gotta see Megan in her, her, in grief. Now this is the same woman that slammed the royal family just less than two weeks ago when she accused in, in, in uh, her interview with Mariah Carey on her podcast, she accused the royal family of being racist. Oh, now you wanna go across the pond on the funer at the funeral of the queen in a very somber and very, uh, oh my God, funerals are hard. I feel it's, it's hard no matter what age the person is. And you decide you want to have this photo op where you got a tear flowing down and we're supposed to fall for it? Come on, Megan. If those were real tears, there were they were not tears about losing Queen Elizabeth. You know that. You call those people racist. If anything, you were quite crying because you screwed it up. You skipped, you messed up your ego. That you could have, if you had humbled yourself and you have kept your ego in check, and I got a theory, you don't have real friends to keep you grounded. In reality, you needed someone in your camp to tell you to snap out of it. It's not about you now. It's about your husband, and you, you guys got two children now. The royal family is where he's from. That's his blood. He will come to resent you, Megan. That's someone in your, in your camp, your family or friend, should have told you, real friends would tell you. You don't have real friends. You, you got succubus like you are. You guys suck the, uh, the, the uh, energy from each other, if not energy, the money, the clout. That's what your, your people, you surround yourself around. Not one person told you the truth. It's to stop it. The royal family is about service. You have to be about that too. They may be wealthy beyond imagination, but these people live their, uh, their lives in a fishbowl. And they no, don't complain, don't explain. That's their attitude. And they just keep going, serving the community, serving their country, serving the empire. Megan, you could not do that because your ego got in the way. So maybe you were crying because you know you screwed up. Now you and Harry got to go come back to the States and you, you know your popularity is going down the drain. I'm sorry, it is. That's because nobody can connect with you. So we're not falling for those tears. If anything, you're not crying uh, because of the a queen. You're crying because you may have screwed it up. I tell you, Megan, I'll tell you again. I'm gonna shoot to you straight, pow, pow. Just like the legendary talk show host, Wendy Williams says. Shoot, shoot to you straight, pow, pow, with love, of course. Megan, go away. Just fade to black for a couple of years. Do it. And just serve the community. If you want to be of service like you claim you are, you do, then stop hoeing for the, stop seeking the limelight. Stop seeking status. Stop seeking attention and just fade to black. Serve the community behind the scenes and give it a good five years. Then come back with mute. We should only see you. We shouldn't hear from you. You or Harry. But Harry can get a little break because Harry is not the one. He's just likable. You got him. But you know, don't mess it up, Megan. And you are messing it up. All right, guys, let me know what you think of this video because I am rambling on. Thanks for watching. I will chat with you soon. Ciao. Love you. Mwah.
I write my stories here, I take my meetings here, and it's kind of amazing because all over the world, if I'm traveling, So House can still be home base. Now make yourself cry. Oh, I can do that so well. Oh my god, it's crazy. You're like, Megan, one tear, left eye, go. Give me three seconds.